the branding aspect of what he did for this program was never the wrong thing to do. Uh, it's just when you don't have the results to back it up, it looks a little silly in the end. Jeff Collins is out as Georgia Tech's head football coach just four games into his fourth season at the helm. The fact that last Saturday in Orlando was a winnable football game and the same mistakes plagued this team ever since year one under Collins. You could tell in the post-game press conference that it was kind of just uh, this impending decision we knew was coming. And although things became official Monday afternoon, the conversations about Collins' eight-figure salary started after a disappointing end of last season. Athletic director Todd Stansberry's decision to stick with him is what ultimately has them both leaving the program on the same day. Donors were ready. They were ready to kind of pony up that money. I think the key word is when he used, he's my guy. And so many words that bought him time. And it also, as we've realized, kind of linked their future together. Now with eight games left on the schedule, assistant head coach Brent Key was promoted to interim head coach. The former Alabama assistant brings something that Kuhn believes this program needs at the right time. This is a guy who is a no-nonsense type of uh, coach. And I think that we could see this team really respond well to a Brent Key-led team. I think he's well-respected uh, in that locker room. You really do believe that you're going to see a different brand, a different style of football. I think it'll be a stark contrast to what the uh, you know the marketing and branding and some of the sizzle that Jeff Collins brought. I think this is kind of uh, you know more just let's up, uh, you know let's just play football, and, and and maybe that's what they need. Covering Georgia Tech football, I'm Reggie Chapman, 11 Live Sports.